ago, in a different age, there was a great king. One year, his kingdom was stricken with a terrible drought, and his people were suffering. He went to his council. Rains is a result of sinful activities. You must cleanse yourself. There's a great sadhu living underneath a tree in a nearby forest. You should go worship him, wash his feet, and pray for his blessings. And only by this process, all your sins will be destroyed. And rain must certainly come. Yes, I will go at once. Our people cannot last much longer. Accept my Dhandavat remarks. Please allow me to wash your feet. Sadhu is suffering from a horrible case of leprosy. His body is decayed severely. Pieces of his rotting flesh have fallen off and have left open, oozing pus sores. The smell of his body is unbearable. I cannot drink this. I will pretend to drink it, but uh, I'll just put the water on my head instead. Oh King, you have deceived me with your duplicity. Although externally, you may act like you're a very honorable person. Inside your heart is full of poison. Therefore, I will cur- <laughs> However, since you did put my parajal upon your head, I will also bless you that Krishna will come and dance upon your head. curse of this great sadhu, the king took birth in the body of a very poisonous and envious snake. His name was Kaliya, and he lived on the island of the serpents. The snakes that lived there had made a pact with Garuda, the carrier of Lord Narayan. They would regularly leave offerings for him, and in return, he would not harass them or eat them. But Kaliya became envious and devised a plan. offerings from us. Who does he think he is? He used to torment all of the snakes. He would eat our family members 
any time he felt hungry. The other snakes think that these offerings will pacify him and keep him from eating us. But I think, I think that I am more powerful, at least just as powerful as Garuda is. So, why should we fear him? In fact, I think, I think I should be the one who gets these offerings. At last, I am safe. Garuda cannot come here. He is forbidden. Due to a curse of Sobari Rishi. Once, Garuda mercilessly ate a harmless fish. Seeing this, Sobari Rishi cursed Garuda that he could never come to this place again. So, I am safe to live here with my family. Because Sobari Rishi had cursed Garuda, who is a great devotee of the Lord, a desire rose in his heart to enjoy the material world. He came out of the waters of the Jamuna, and by his yogic power, transformed himself into a young man. He married many beautiful young daughters of Maharaj Mandata and remained entangled in worldly pleasures for thousands of years. Because of Kaliya's presence, the water of the Jamuna became filled with poison. His dangerous fiery vapors constantly heated and boiled the waters. The vapors were so poisonous that if a bird happened to even pass over the area, it would immediately die and fall down into the water. Simply by coming in contact with the poisonous breeze, all vegetation and creatures on the shore died. The trees and grass near the bank of the Jamuna all dried up. Thus, Kaliya, the embodiment of fear, lived with all his wives and children on a small island hidden in the waters of the Kalindi. One day, Vanamali Krishna left his brother Balaram at home and went out with his friends.
I'm so thirsty. Me too. Let's go and get a drink at the Yamuna. to my friends. Oh, it must be due to the poison of that serpent, Kalia. I must teach him a lesson. Wonderful Krishna is, hmm? He rescued us, just like he did when we wandered into the cave like mouth of Agasura. Ah, cute, hi. You guys, just stay here and watch the cows. I'll be back very soon. Come back down here and play with us. Krishna. Krishna, kya kar rahe ho, Baba? What are you doing? Oh, yeah. Krishna sported in the water like a lordly elephant, swirling and splashing with his mighty hands and making the water resound with a thunderous roar. When Kalia heard these sounds, he understood someone was trespassing in his lake. The serpent could not tolerate this and immediately came forward. Shaking with anger, Kalia furiously lunged at Krishna and bit him on the chest. After a vicious fight, Krishna allowed himself to be bound in the coils of the snake. Meanwhile, back in the village, Nanda Baba and the elder Brajbasis noticed some very inauspicious omens and were filled with anxiety. Your heart is burning 
and you are overcome with lamentation. <coughs> Nevertheless, you need not be in anxiety. Oh, Maya, do not cry or lament. Remember the words of Gargacharya. He said that you would be saved from all obstacles by this boy. Keeping this in mind, don't you think that Krishna will be released from this danger? If you jump in the river and drown, who will raise and maintain Krishna when he comes out of the water? Just as the wind cannot conquer a mountain, or as darkness can never cover the sun, Krishna is not the least bit afraid of this tiny water snake. <laughs> My dear Brajvasis, please give up your grief. Any moment now, my brother will come out and be with us. Oh, Kalia, you have shown me enough of your strength. Let me show you a little of my prowess, even though I am just a mere coward boy. <laughs> Change that is coming over him. 
His face is showing signs of remorse, regret. He is even showing signs of surrender. <laughs> How wonderful would it be if he became a servant of our Lord Sri Krishna? If he surrenders to the Lord, then all our lives will be auspicious. Then our chastity will be protected and we can perform bhajan together. We should appeal to the Lord to spare his life. within this world to punish the wicked and cruel persons. O oh, Prabhu, you are so impartial that you treat your own sons and your own enemies equally. For when you bestow a punishment upon a living being, you know it to be for the best of his purpose. to be understood as your mercy. for centuries for this end. Oh Prabhu, this serpent is about to give up his life. At least once a master can tolerate an offense made by his child. Oh Prabhu, please forgive our husband for he did not understand who you are. Supreme Lord, <laughs> amongst all the numerous species within your material creation, we snakes, by nature, are always enraged. 
My birth as a snake has left me always envious, ignorant, and mostly angry. <laughs> this is my conditioned nature. Therefore, you may do with me as you desire, whether it be mercy or punishment. It is not possible for me to overcome this on my own, for you are the cause of freedom from illusion. Oh, Serpent Kalia, you may not stay here. If you remain here, you will frighten all of my Brajabasis. You can return to the ocean and take along with you all of your wives and children. Let my Jamuna River be enjoyed by all the cows, calves, and all of the people of Braj. Because of Garuda, you left Samanaka Island, and you came here in the shelter of this lake. But, because now you have my footprints upon your heads, Garuda will not try to eat you. Oh, Supreme Lord, even though I am the most fallen, you have showered your mercy upon me. Just by placing your lotus feet upon my head. I now can realize that Garuda was not my enemy. Even though I was so inimical to him. But I have received the blessings of your lotus feet upon my head. Only due to the mercy of Garuda. Oh my Lord. Kaliya worshipped the Lord with sandalwood paste and fine garments, along with necklaces, jewels, and other valuable ornaments. Being pleased with Kaliya, Krishna placed his lotus hand on Kaliya's head and removed all his pain. <coughs> After receiving the, the Lord's permission to leave, Kaliya circumambulated him and offered pranams. Taking his wives and children, he left to his island in the sea. So by the mercy of Garuda, the sadhu, and the association of his wives, who were very high-class devotees, Kaliya attained the lotus feet of the Lord. Kaliya also had resided in Braj for many days, and by the mercy of the Dham, he attained the highest treasure, which is so difficult to attain. Nitai God Ramanande. successful. <laughs> so my blessing to whole party. Ashley <laughs> Krishna.
नागपत्नी जॉब एंड फर्स्ट लाइफ टू फर्स्ट लाइफ so i see that trauma is all around successful yeah. by heartly blessings to you all and director and who is director <laughs> my first blessing is to go director 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 what name director and then to go to mar